welcome to my channel. I'm Subhi and today with me I have my uh, Croatian friend who is going to explain us a Croatian traditional dish for us. Uh, hi Anna and uh, uh, welcome to my channel. And she is a great mom, a culinary student who worked in actual restaurants but now she is only cooking for her kid. But she is amazing and she is going to show us a traditional Croatian dish. Uh, so can you tell about Croatia and your favorite dish? Of course. Uh, welcome to my kitchen. Thank you Thanks. for inviting. <laughs> I hope you will enjoy it all mm -hmm. and it won't be hard for you. I decided to start with easy, quick and simple dish, but very popular. Mm -hmm. It's traditional. Um, I think there is no person who don't like this dish. Mm -hmm. And in Slovakia, uh, this, uh, this recipe uh, have really big success. Mm -hmm. Everybody likes it, but it, because it's simple, I think, you know. Mm -hmm. it, the taste is like donuts, mm -hmm. but it looks different. It's like little balls. Mm -hmm. And uh, ingredients also are simple. You can find it in your house, I think, most of the time. So I think there won't be a problem. Great. So let's go get into the ingredients and see how simple and tasty this dish is. So. Like we are starting, okay? Mm -hmm. We will use this for garbage. Mm -hmm. okay. I will not use the mixer mm -hmm. because I don't want to make noise. On other, on another side, I want to show like our grandmas. They, did they not didn't have, have mixer, mm -hmm. exactly. so, so this dish is like proper traditional yes. one. Yeah. yeah. So we will we will do it traditionally by this old way. Mm -hmm. Get messy with our hands. <laughs> the sugar, four spoons, mm -hmm. as I said. We can put vanilla sugar. Mm -hmm. One. It gives a vanilla taste, so I'm not afraid of vanilla sugar. I use it very much. Yeah, the aroma is very good. Yes, in yes. anything you put. Yeah. Yes. I am recently experimenting many of the uh, baking stuff because I'm not really uh, good at baking, but mm -hmm. I'm trying to learn multiple stuff. Yes. So we will start like easy. Uh huh. So it shouldn't be it shouldn't be difficult. Mm -hmm. So almost one cup of yogurt. Two cups. Of two yogurt. cups. Two, two cups, cups of, of yogurt. yogurt. Yes. yes. Also, it gives Anna eyes a little better taste mm -hmm. and, and the texture when you put yogurt because mm -hmm. the dough is it's like it's easier. How can I say it? It's, it's more tasty mm -hmm. when there's a yogurt. Mm -hmm. We can put baking powder. We daily use, I mean, in our daily life, we mm -hmm. use caffeine, the uh -huh. curd, curd yes. uh, which is uh, usually in our households it's general yes. to be, you know, even uh, in Kerala we make multiple dishes mm -hmm. with that. Uh, we call that morgari, which mm -hmm. is made from that. So, yeah. I use uh, soda, like mm -hmm. uh, soda bicarbona, yes. every night. Yeah. And, uh, and baking powder, but I use soda also. Mm -hmm. So five, five tablespoons of uh, flour? It, it's 20 uh, uh -huh. spoons of flour, but I will start like slowly, easy. Mm -hmm. With mixer it's easier. But so you don't have lumps, yeah? No. Yeah. Yes. See, mm -hmm. we miss mixer. <laughs> <laughs> But let's keep it authentical. Mm -hmm. So, do you eat spicy foods or no? no? I'm from uh, I'm from Mediterranean kitchen, so we have we we have a, sim a simple tastes and uh, not so much uh, not so much intensive uh -huh. spices. So our only spice. <laughs> It's vinegar. Okay. <laughs> a vinegar, oh, well, it's it's pepper vinegar. and yeah. you know, mm -hmm. vegeta. Yeah. <laughs> vegeta is our product, so mm -hmm. so these are our spices. But of course, some people use chili. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. Uh, we are getting to know curry, uh -huh. you know, and uh, but I don't like so 
Mm -hmm. So spicy food. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you now it's more difficult. Mm -hmm. But from now, we will use. This is the consistency we'll be needing and as Anna was saying, uh, the rum we are adding is going to help you not absorb the oil when you're frying it as a deep fry. How we check the oil is heated, there is one simple trick on it. We take a wooden spoon, we put it in the oil, mm -hmm. oil mm -hmm. and when you see bubbles around this wooden uh, spoon, it means the heat is the right. Yeah, I can see the bubbles and the bubbles. Heat is right enough, yes. yeah. So we have oil ready mm -hmm. and uh, this glass is filled with water, but important warm water. Uh, later you will see why I use spoons, they will be they will uh, they will keep in touch with the uh, with the dough so we put this this uh, spoon in in water mm -hmm. so it won't be sticky and, the, and this dough will fall e easier on the oil, on the oil. Okay. so it, it's just important to, to have uh, warm water okay okay and meanwhile we can also tell about croatia <laughs> okay yeah i uh, First, you need to promise me you will go to Croatia. I will. I'm waiting to go to yes. Croatia. Please. From yeah, India, yeah. it goes far, but from Slovakia, you yes. have it like yeah. a half yes. day of ride. Yes. But to Dalmatia, <laughs> uh, of course, we have Istria. It's wonderful. It's close. It's closer, but um, but Dalmatia is more historical, uh -huh. as it was a part of Romanian Empire. So the architecture history is is written down yeah. in the Everstone, so it's really beauty. And also we have sea, of course. Yeah, I have seen the pictures, coast. I really love yes, it. Yes, I, I have love to visit. Yeah. yeah, wonderful coast, amazing kitchen, so. Mm -hmm. And this one, of course, mm -hmm. in every corner. Mm -hmm. The name is Fritule, say yeah. it. Fritule. Fritule, great. <laughs> I can say it. <laughs> and Riba. 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 Riba is, do you know what is Riba? Yeah, I think here it's fish. Fish, right? yeah. yes, in Croatia also, yes, in Slovak we also say Riba. Mm -hmm. So this is the most, like the, the, the shortest way how to describe Croatia. Yeah, we, I mean we are also from coastal, yes. so we love fish, so here I don't think we get fresh fishes, you know? No. Don't you miss yes. them? I miss it very. Me too. <laughs> yes, the only, the only fish I eat here is lasos. Yeah. Uh, lasos in English. Uh, uh, salmon. Small salmon. 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 Yes, yeah. salmon. Mm -hmm. So, but uh, sea fish, I really miss sea fish yes, yes the fresh is the best we put it on the grill a little bit of garlic olive oil, oil parsley and finished, and finished. Yeah. so simple and easy as this will be uh, we are mediterranean kitchen mm -hmm. it, it's it's simple kitchen simple tastes simple ingredients mm -hmm. something new for you maybe <laughs> yeah but, for us we are loaded with spices yes Coconuts and we put all uh, coconuts in almost everything. Yes. Coconut, coconut milk, grated coconut, everything. Yes, we don't have this. We we keep it simple uh -huh. but tasty, and that's why it's, um, it's not so risky. You mm -hmm. know, it's it, you know maybe for you it would be tasty because it's not so complicated. You know, yeah. when you give me Indian dish, I could be like I don't know this, 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 yes. and it can be really complicated to me and. Uh, and uh, difficult but I like trying so <laughs> but yeah there are many reasons behind those spices you know each one resembles uh, either it's for the aroma not only for the aroma yes. most of them are immunity boosters yes, yes. They take I like care of this. digestion I like this yes, yes. But a Mediterranean kitchen is also one of the healthiest because mm -hmm. we don't use many fat. Mm -hmm. You know yeah. we we really keep it simple and uh, and uh, Today we have a lot of oil, <laughs> but rum helps it. But mostly we have we have like like very very light light, light food. Yes, that's so, great. Also healthy as well. Too. Yes, yes. So we can start. Mm -hmm. We need to get messy. I put all my rings down because okay. I don't have my hand in dough. It's easier yeah. and it's 
Um, it's about hygiene also. So we can start. The worst part is put this hand first time, but you know, you can do it with spoons. I will show uh, how you, I can show you first like how we do these balls with with spoons, spoons yeah. but they are more prettier when you do it with the hands. Uh -huh. Our grandmas wasn't crazy, weren't crazy, so <laughs> they done it all with hands. That's why I wanted to keep it authentical. Mm -hmm. You know, you see, you need to do this, and it's a very long process. Yeah. And you make it into a ball. Yes, I'm okay. making a ball, and it it can keep it can keep a while. You know, it can take a while. And I put it there, and you will see the difference be between this ball and, and the handmade one. And the handmade one. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> see? Oh, you need to try. Yeah. Yes. I, I wash my hands. I be, I, yes, of course. Okay, come here. I will show you. You can okay. make the next. The, the next round yeah. so you have dough in your hand you squish <laughs> it and you you got this ball and you oh. just take it with the spoon and put it in the oil that's why oh. we need clean clean uh, spoons yeah, so the balls nice. will be prettier don't take it too much yeah okay, okay. yes and see this is the first ah, ball. I got it. Yeah. <laughs> this one is the big one. Oh, I should make it yes. small. smaller. You need to double. <laughs> okay. no? And try to put it in the oil. Yes. Great. See, just a little, like to stick on your hands and you squish it. And you have better balls when they are small. Okay? Yeah. So, like this. I am always you, bad you, with oil. Yes, you need to put it lower. Okay, yeah, I have yes. a little bit because I don't have to see so much big. Yeah. So I take it more. <laughs> but it's funny, right? Yeah, it's also cute. I mean, yes. it's coming into a proper ball. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> the nice. balls are perfect. Yeah. See, it's easier than, and it's quicker, as you see, than with these oh, two spoons. It's flattering. Yes. An Indian making free tour. <laughs> I never oh, expected to see this, but I'm very happy. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so glad I met you. Perfect. Oops. And you, you, every time you start to uh, try to get rid of water. Yeah, okay, that's okay. the reason for the Yes. See. And not uh, don't throw them to the oil, just put them like, oh, like yeah. this. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, see? Okay. It's in, you like it? <laughs> yeah, it, it looks lovely. Yeah. Actually, we have something called a bonda, mm -hmm. which is something like this. Um, but it looks lovely. I'm waiting for yes. this. <laughs> and it takes a really few minutes. Uh, these balls are, are swimming in this oil. You need to have maybe three or four centimeters of oil. Mm -hmm. It can touch the bottom. Mm -hmm. You need them floating mm -hmm. in this oil yeah. and then they turn around by themselves. You don't need to turn them around. Oh, oh once one side is cooked. Oh, yeah, I can see. Wow. Yes, they, are, oh, they are moving wow. One minute. So I now we will wait. Yeah. I will get rid of this a little because I don't need again. Oh my god, it's so cutely turning. And I think my shapes are not that good. <laughs> no, it's great. Yeah. It's the one is And after that we will put it on this uh, paper towel mm -hmm. for any case. For this extra oil from the spoon mostly, not from there, see, because mm -hmm. when I will put them, the oil will will fall see mm -hmm. and now we wait for a couple minutes maybe two three minutes depends okay. on the heat mm -hmm. and as you can see i don't have some modern uh, modern uh, <laughs> cutlery uh, yeah. cutlery it's like it's from special material of course you can make it in any but it's like it's better in this grandma Cutlery, <laughs> you know. Yeah, I even use uh, this ever silver kind of yes, material. Yes, you home. can use it. You can use anything, 
but you know, it's like made for this. Mm -hmm. And when you reach, when you reach color like this, yeah, golden brown. Yes, it's it's done. It's perfect. Looks it so should lovely. be done. <laughs> if you if you open it and it's raw, you need to, you need a small uh, uh, put down the heat. Yeah. It means they were uh, they were done quick from the outside yeah. and not from the inside. Yeah, you yeah. just have to cook it on medium flame. Yes. And if it's uh, if you think it's not cooked, then just simmer the heat and yes, it's perfect. It's perfect. I'm waiting. You to need to play <laughs> with this, and but it's as you see, it's not difficult. It's very simple. Yeah. And it's very it's cheap. <laughs> it's cheap actually. It's a quick snack yes. for the evening. Yes. Even if you get, uh, have yes. seven guests, then I think you can make yes. it. Yeah. And everybody loves it. Yeah, yes. I'm going to try it. <laughs> yes. Everybody loves it. Yeah. We, we used to have uh, these uh, pastes made from different you know, onions, tomatoes, yes. Yes. just like your sauce, but mm -hmm. it's not sweet. We make it a spicy one. Yes. So for all these kinds of snacks, we used to, you know, instead of sauce, yes. we use the chutney. You know, that's uh, it's like a grinded paste yes. uh, and it's spicy and tangy. So I'm going to teach you one of my mom's yes. favorite in my next I'm, session. I'm uh, looking forward. <laughs> I'm very sure. curious. My mom was like giving me the recipe a few weeks ago and I mm -hmm. was like, I'm going to make it because one of my friends in India, uh, she was with me when I was in Bangalore mm -hmm. and she was my roommate. Manu, thank you so much. <laughs> so she loves my mom's um, uh, face and mm -hmm. she was asking for the recipe. I told yeah. her I'll be giving it soon. So next I'm going to teach her yes, as well as you, good. okay? I need to try new things. Yeah. But my husband likes spicy. Yeah. Very spicy, so it won't be a problem. You can see how beautifully it's turning on its own if you give some space. Uh, the balls get the right heat. Yeah. As we finish it, uh, we can serve it clean with powdered sugar or with chocolate. So, with chocolate, we can do like this. Okay, a little messy, don't worry. Okay, and, and we add some powdered sugar to the other half. How looks wonderful. And it's done. <laughs> Beautiful. Thank you so much for this wonderful fritole. Fritole. Fritole, yeah. I'm, I'm going to try right. one of chocolate and one of one the of sugar. sugar. It it is exactly tasting like a cake, but it was so simple yes. to make. You don't need an oven or anything. Or mixer, you can you can do yourself. Everything mm -hmm. is, is fried in oil, oil, but you don't feel it. Yeah, I don't feel any bit of no, oil. No, it's so dry, but but yet so soft and it's because of rum. Yeah, <laughs> don't forget to add rum. <laughs> yes, I'm very happy. I'm very happy and I'm very thankful. Thank you so much for your time and I'm going to try this as well. Mm. With sugar also it's perfect, it's awesome. Do try this at home and let me know in the comments um, how did you like this fritule and uh, let us also know in the comment section if you need any more uh, European recipes and the wonderful chef here she's going to cook us for Thank you and i'm going to teach her indian in the next uh, segment don't miss it go back to, to try something in the end but yeah. not to try to eat it because uh, i ate it but i'm looking forward to make it yeah you yeah. need to teach me like sure, uh, you sure, need to sure, show me your spices and everything i'm i'm really curious and mm -hmm. open to everything so great so we'll see you in the next segment, which is going to be an Indian dish and she's going to learn from me, I guess. Bye-bye. Ahoy.